Curiositos, curiositas, ¿qué tal estáis? ¿Todo bien por ahí? Por aquí estupendamente, deseando que llegue el verano, porque estoy harta del cielo nublado, de la lluvia y del frío, así que bueno, paciencia, ya nos han cambiado la hora, ya hemos dado un pasito más, ya se acerca el veranito. Hoy os traigo un nuevo dictado. ¿Por qué? Porque me estáis diciendo que os viene fenomenal y lo cierto es que es un ejercicio muy bueno para practicar el listening, el writing, repasar estructuras gramaticales, vocabulario, así que bueno, como nos viene fenomenal, vamos a seguir haciendo esta serie de dictados con textos cortitos y el de hoy es muy sencillito. Hoy hablamos de un vecino y hablamos de sus rutinas, así que si ya estás ¿Listo? Ponte la pila, coge el lápiz y papel porque os empiezo a dictar. Ya sabes que después del dictado os dejo la corrección, así que no pauses el vídeo, que después te digo si lo has hecho bien. Vamos a ello. Comenzamos. I have a very nice neighbor. Repito. I have a very nice neighbor. Stop. Puntito. His name is Tom. His name is Tom. Stop. He loves to walk on the mountain. He loves to walk on the mountain. Stop. During The week during the week he wakes up early. Repito, during the week he wakes up early and goes for a small walk on the mountain. Repito todo esto. During the week, he wakes up early and goes for a small walk on the mountain. Stop. He usually He usually goes with his brother. I repeat, he usually goes with his brother. Stop, puntito. They like to get some fresh air they like to get some fresh air before they start the day Repito esta última frase. They like to get some fresh air before they start the day. Stop. Puntito. They live in the country. They live in the country, far away, far away 
from the city. I repeat. They live in the country far away from the city. Stop. Puntito. They think that their country life they think that their country life is wonderful they think that their country life is Wonderful. Stop. In the country, they are away from the noise and pollution of the city. I repeat, repito. In the country, they are away from the noise and pollution of the city. Stop. They often, they often walk for about one hour. They often walk for about one hour and then and then they return home. Repito todo. They often walk for about one hour and then return home. Stop. Punto. They always take the bus. They always take the bus after their walk. I repeat. They always take the bus after their walk. At about 8.30 in the morning. At about 8.30 in the morning and arrive at the clinic at 9 a.m. Stop. Repito todo. They always take the bus after their walk at about 8.30 in the morning and arrive at the clinic at 9 a.m. 
stop. He is a vet. He is a vet. And loves to help animals. Stop. Repito esto último. He is a vet and loves to help animals. Y con esto y un bizcocho hemos terminado el dictadito de hoy. Fíjate bien en aquellas palabras que no conocías y me dejas en comentarios qué tal te ha salido. Vamos a ver la corrección. No pauses el vídeo que viene por aquí. Pues vamos a comprobar qué tal te ha salido este dictado. Recuerda buscar en el diccionario todas aquellas palabras que no conozcas. I had a very nice neighbor. His name is Tom. He loves to walk on the mountain. During the week, he wakes up early and goes for a small walk on the mountain. He usually goes with his brother. They like to get some fresh air before they start the day. They live in the country, far away from the city. They think that country life is wonderful. In the country, They are away from the noise and pollution of the city. They often walk for about one hour and then return home. They always take the bus after their walk at about 8.30 in the morning and arrive at the clinic at 9 a.m. He is a vet and loves to help animals. Déjame en los comentarios qué tal te ha ido esta vez.